Welcome to my channel Living Linux. This is just a short video to show you the screen recording capabilities of the Raja Rock 5B when you're running Android and you have access to the hardware video decoder and encoder. And this is similar to the Micotronics R58 or R58X. So first I'd like to start with a YouTube video while we're screen recording. So we'll choose 4K resolution. So let's give it some time to buffer Well, as we also saw in my earlier video, that this Android image is not really optimized yet. Um, when I compare it with the Micotronics R58 with the same ROC chip RK3588, it should be no problem to record YouTube uh, with a screen recorder while you're playing YouTube in 4K. So it looks like we yeah, still need some more optimizations um, with this Android image. And the other thing that some people might want to do is record the HDMI in port. Now, there's one thing also with the Micotronics that uh, as soon as you start HDMI in with a screen recorder that you get a conflict over the microphone. So that means that yeah, while you're recording HDMI in, uh, when you want to do that, then you need to have uh, something else to record the audio. And unfortunately, with the Rock 5, it doesn't record the input. Uh, so I know that with the Micotronics, uh, I have done that before. So it should be possible. So hopefully Racha can fix that in the future. Um, so I will start it just quickly. You will only see a black screen. Um, I can actually see what is actually displayed uh, on the HDMI import, but it doesn't uh, get recorded by the screen recorder. So now we're back again. Um, yeah, I think Raja still needs to do a lot of optimizations, uh, both with Android and with Linux. And I saw that today they released a new Linux image. So perhaps tomorrow I will have a look at that. Um, at least the good thing is, is that uh, it seems that they're still actively developing uh, at least the Linux image and hopefully also the Android image. Uh, so as soon as we get those new images and hopefully also that things start working comparable with the Micotronics, then I will do a new video. 
So that's all for now, and I hope to see you again in my next video.